Let's get started. Oil prices recently dropped below $80 a barrel. You know what they say, it's all Bush's fault. <laughs> A survey of America's top CEOs shows 74% of them say an Obama presidency would be disastrous for America's economy. Or, as the mainstream media calls this survey, not newsworthy. <laughs> John McCain's advisors are growing increasingly worried about him coming off as grumpy. McCain couldn't be reached for comment because he was too busy firing those advisors for daring to suggest that he is not the most cheerful son of a in the whole guy universe. <laughs> Reuters is saying a bad economy is good for the environment because it will cause factories to close. Yep, poverty, starvation, and death. Or as Reuters calls it, going green. <laughs> 4,000 dead people have been found on the voter rolls in Houston. Apparently 2,000 came from Democrats copying the names off of tombstones at a Houston cemetery and the other 2,000 were signed up at a Neil Diamond concert. <laughs> Some high school football players in New Mexico have been accused of sodomizing other boys with a broomstick, or, as it's known at Elton John's house, sweeping up. <laughs> People everywhere are stressed about the economy, but not me, mostly because I'm Moonlight as Amy Winehouse's crack dealer. <laughs> And finally, a new study claims that one in four mammals is threatened with extinction, which sounds serious, until you realize it could be one of these four. <laughs> Thanks for watching News Busted, everybody. I'm Jody Miller. Be sure to subscribe to our videos. We'll catch you next time.